In this episode of Bee Hooked Knitting, I'm going to demonstrate how to knit the Continental Pearl. My name is Brittany and I'll be your guide throughout this tutorial. You might use the Continental Pearl if you are more comfortable with crocheting and holding the yarn in your non-dominant hand. Let's see just how to do the Continental Pearl. Many of us find that holding the yarn in our non-dominant hand is the most comfortable when we're knitting, especially if we were crocheters before we became knitters. That's something that I started doing when I first learned to knit. I had already learned to crochet first, so I was always more comfortable holding the yarn in my non-dominant hand. Working knit stitches this in this continental style is pretty simple. It's actually very straightforward, but what about pearls? Pearls are the opposite of the knit stitch, and I just really couldn't wrap my brain around how we were supposed to hold the yarn in our non-dominant hand and make this pearl work. So what I have here is just a little swatch to demonstrate how to do the continental pearl. You're gonna gather up your yarn just like normal, and you wanna have your working yarn coming out the front of your work. If you allow your yarn to drape over your index finger here, you wanna free up your middle finger because you're gonna use this to push down on the working yarn just like this. Before we can insert our needle into the stitch that we want to work, we have to pull the working yarn out of the way. So we'll do that with our left hand. We'll just pull it down and out of the way, insert our needle, then release push it back down and finish the stitch. Now let's do that one more time. You'll push your working yarn out of the way in the stitch, wrap it around. And you can see I just kind of help push the stitch off of my needle with my thumb. Now since my little swatch has a garter stitch border on each side, let's just quickly look at how to do the continental knit stitch. So I'm holding the yarn to the back of my work. And that's how you do the continental pearl stitch. <laughs> 